What do you put inside your helmet? Think it's just your head? Every one of your memories, everything that you know, everything that you are goes inside your helmet. Your brain's in there, and it wasn't built for impacts out on the road. That's why this was invented. When you're a motorcyclist, a real helmet is by far the most important piece of equipment to have on every single ride. Here's a look at what makes a good helmet and what makes a bad one. We study helmets here in this research lab. We test them thoroughly, thousands of them. We can tell the difference between a good helmet that will protect your brain and a fake or novelty item that doesn't deserve to be called a helmet and won't do anything for you in a crash. No one expects to crash, but thousands do each year, and head injury is a leading cause of death in motorcycle crashes. Helmets might look about the same, but on the inside, they're not. Four critical components make up a protective helmet. Obviously, there's the hard outer shell, the first defense against an impact. It holds everything together, resists penetration and abrasion. It's made from thermoplastic or a composite such as fiberglass. The manufacturers of a protective helmet put a lot of thought into the design and thorough care into the production of each one. Since you need to see, there needs to be an eye port in the front of a full face helmet, but that's covered with another critical part, the face shield. They aren't just made of any old clear plastic. It's super tough polycarbonate and also designed to deflect objects that can injure your face and eyes. Remember, at highway speeds, even a pebble kicked up by a car in front of you can be devastating. Face shields are tested and have to meet certain standards. And of course, they're designed to provide you with better, clearer vision, sealing it against the helmet with a gasket to keep out the wind and large enough to let you see all around, even to your sides. You have clear shields for night use, tinted shields for daytime, and some helmets that offer both with a flip down feature. Good helmets with proper eye protection don't limit your vision, they improve it. A good helmet also cuts down on wind noise, which would otherwise mask important road and traffic sounds. Yet, it allows road and traffic noise, including car horns, to be easily heard. Some riders prefer a three-quarter or open face helmet, which can protect the top and back of your head, or one with even less coverage. But nothing beats a full facial coverage helmet for protecting your face, chin, and teeth. Turning to the inside of the helmet, first we see the retention straps, made of a durable nylon and cinched together with metal D-rings or a quick connect buckle. It's absolutely vital that they're properly, snugly fastened whenever you put your helmet on. Without them, the helmet may fly off in a crash. Next, we see the soft and spongy comfort lighting, nice fabric covered foam. It's there so the helmet will feel good on your head mile after mile, absorb perspiration, and allow you to keep your attention focused on the road. It's also there to help provide that very important snug fit particularly around your cheeks, and keep the helmet where it needs to be instead of rolling around over your head. It's underneath the comfort lining that we find the last component, and a huge difference between a real helmet and a fake. The energy-absorbing liner, this thick white part made of expanded polystyrene, or EPS. This EPS is the critical component that protects your brain. It's designed to crush and deform in a crash as it absorbs the impact. It's designed to spread the impact energy over time and distance in a controlled way. In that way, your soft brain doesn't slam too hard up against the inside of your skull. And that's what this all-important piece of engineering is designed to prevent. Here's an impact test to show you exactly what I'm talking about. This is how a real helmet performs in a crash. This is an impact with a DOT qualified helmet. You can see that the impact goes up soft, stops at 200 G's, and comes back down again. Now, look at what happens with a fake helmet. This is the impact with the Novelty helmet. It goes so high, it's off the chart. It didn't absorb any energy. It would allow severe brain damage. What you have here is the difference between a headache that will go away and severe brain damage that won't. You have to have an EPS liner to provide real protection. You probably know this from your own experience. At some point in your life, you probably bumped your head against a hard object, and it really hurt. Even if you just fall down in a simple tip-over and hit your head on pavement, you can badly injure your brain. A real helmet can save your life. A fake helmet won't. 
For motorcyclists, novelty helmets are a very bad joke. We can see how they don't work. No EPS liner and fragile retention system, so the helmet simply rolls off your head. A real helmet has a DOT label on the back and labels inside showing that this helmet design has been tested and meets the U.S. Department of Transportation standard. Make sure your helmet is DOT compliant. Look for it on the helmetcheck.org website. A real helmet will reduce the risk of brain injury by 67% and the risk of death by 37%. Don't you want those better odds? Don't you think your brain deserves it? When you're riding a motorcycle, either at five miles an hour or at freeway speeds, you should give your head and your brain the best protection possible. Get a properly fitted protective helmet. Strap it on and wear it every single ride. Whenever you're riding a motorcycle, minimize your risk by making all the right decisions. When it comes to protective gear, do what real riders do. Even if your state doesn't require it, strap on a quality helmet. If you already wear a half or three quarter helmet, try a full face helmet like this one and protect your face too. This video is about helmets, but you also have to protect the rest of your body. Real riders wear all the right protection. Jacket, long pants, boots, gloves, full proper motorcycle riding protection. Get into it on every ride.